Episode 3. How to address being treated unfairly at work. Oh, hello. If you feel you're being treated unfairly at work, what should you do? Maybe meal breaks are going missing, hours worked don't match hours paid, or Gary keeps taking your stapler and when he gives it back, there are no staples left. I mean, it was full when you took it, Gary. <laughs> what could you possibly be stapling that needs so many staples? I mean, we work in a paperless office. You know, some other um, relatable scenario. When you feel like your rights are being violated at work, bringing it up can be uncomfortable. Follow these three steps to work out the issue and find a resolution. Step one, set a time to have the conversation when you're cool, calm and collected. Don't have the conversation when everyone is emotional. It's just a stapler, after all. <laughs> Make it clear that you want to come to a resolution and plan a time in the near future to have a chat so everyone is prepared to move forward in a comfortable and reasonable way. Step 2. Take the time to prepare and gain an understanding of your rights and entitlements. Your employer may not be across all their obligations, so it's worth checking to make sure your entitlements are being fulfilled. Head to the Fair Work website to find out what rights you have. And while you're online, why not check out staplers.com.org.au. It's got lots of cool stuff on there, all of the latest models. No, no, I'm not obsessed. I just, I miss my stapler. See, how dare you? Step three, have a conversation and ask, what's up? I know this may feel uncomfortable, but that's totally normal. If the issue is about pay or agreement conditions, clarify what award you're on and what entitlements you are owed. Mistakes happen, and if there's a discrepancy, your employer will probably want to sort it out. If you need to talk to your employer, have examples and evidence to back you up. Stick to the issue, don't make it personal, and don't go in with your claws out. Leave that to the professionals, like a wolverine, and other claw-handed folk like crabs, or whatever. So, where to from here? If trying to sort it out directly with your employer doesn't work, there are places where you can seek help. Bigger businesses might have a human resources team who can look into issues or mediate discussions. Wait, if they're a bigger business, they might have a whole stationary department with hundreds of staplers, as far as the eye can see. Um, that's besides the point. Um, remember, the Fair Work Ombudsman is there to help if it all gets a bit too much. Or if you're a member of a union, you can ask them for help too. Oh, Gary. You made me an apology card out of staples. You do get me. Maybe we're not so different after all. Resolving workplace and stapler issues.